China has a reputation for producing knockoffs and cheap goods. In fact, most people actively try to avoid Chinese products, especially when buying tech-related items online. If you're one of those people, then you might be surprised to learn that China is at the top of the list when it comes to making tech items. Sure, they do manufacture a lot of knockoffs, but that's only because there's a market for such products. When there's demand, it's good business to offer supply. China has recently climbed through the ranks of the smartphone world too. Due to some smart policies by the government, most tech manufacturers go straight to China when it's time to launch a new product. This strategy of making its industry super accessible for new designers has led to the Chinese tech industry getting involved in some pretty weird and wacky goods. Today, we're going to take a look at some of those products. Number 1. Eco-Friendly Buses China was the world's most polluted country for many years, and the amount of air pollution in its capital was so bad that just breathing it reduced life expectancy. A video went viral showing that you could actually make a brick of filth just by vacuuming the air, which shocked and amazed people around the globe. As the pressure by both international and national groups increased, China was forced to make some drastic changes to the way its entire system operated. Coal and gas power plants were abandoned and solar farms were adopted instead. The biggest contributor to pollution, however, was the transportation industry, which was left mostly untouched until the middle of 2019. China adopted a new green policy that year and eco-friendly buses were introduced. China took their green initiative seriously and changed for the better. As of the release of this video, 99% of all the eco-friendly buses in the world belong to China. These buses utilize electricity instead of gas, and given that this electricity is green too, the carbon footprint of these buses is close to zero. A report by Bloomberg showed that China produces more new electric buses in one day than all the electric buses presently in use in London, the exact number being almost 9,500 buses daily. Number 2. Vertical Farms while indoor plants and gardening have become a major trend in recent years, the global pandemic really made this industry take off. You might have seen this particular trend of growing plants vertically instead of horizontally. China takes it to the next level though. You see, China is a big country at approximately 9.5 million square kilometers. Its population, however, is even bigger at a staggering 1.39 billion people. Accommodating all these people in a relatively small area isn't an easy task and it becomes even more difficult difficult when traditional agriculture techniques use up so much land. You can put people in skyscrapers to reduce the amount of land they occupy, but what about plants? Well, China has decided to put them in skyscrapers too. This method of growing plants is super efficient, and the plants grown this way not only have higher quality yield, but also better growth. The optimal conditions for each plant's growth are replicated exactly in labs, leading to these impressive results. These vertical garden skyscrapers can be built as tall as necessary, and each level is then optimized to grow a specific plant. The idea was originally proposed by Hong Kong engineers, but now has been upscaled to provide for the entire country. Everything the plant needs from sunlight, water, minerals, humidity, etc. can be set and monitored to create the best possible conditions for food growth. It's truly phenomenal. Number 3. Robotic Hotels If you're active on social media, you've probably seen at least one video of a robotic waiter in a hotel. Yes, America got those too, you might be thinking, but what China has done is something way beyond that. Introducing the perfect hotel for introverts, China has recently unveiled a fully automatic hotel. You don't need to interact with a single human being in this hotel. Robots handle everything for you. You don't even need keys for your room, as fingerprint and face recognition systems open the up automatically for you. Checking into these hotels is a breeze too because computer-guided systems enter in your data and make everything as smooth and efficient as possible. Need to turn on the TV or turn off the light? No need to get up, your wish is their command. Most appliances in the hotel work via voice command, all you need to do is speak and the computer does everything for you. This is also expected to reduce costs in the hotel industry because hotel owners won't need to pay for a full-time wait staff, they can automate just just about everything, making things cheaper for them and easier for the client. Number 4. Smart Robots 
Children are fun, but let's be honest, they can be a little annoying or difficult at times. This is especially an issue when a doctor needs to take a kid's temperature or check if everything looks alright. You might think tech to keep your kids still and engage while effectively checking their vital signs is impossible. China has just introduced a robot that does just that. These smart robots have been built for kids to check their temperature, measure their weight, and generally make sure that everything is okay. They're fun and interactive for the kids, but most importantly, they help doctors too. Even though an actual doctor is recommended for more thorough care or specific concerns, these bots are very useful for daily checkups. Reduced human interaction has also become more important during the pandemic, so these robots help keep people safe from unnecessary human exposure too. Daily checkups in preschools are done with these robots so doctors can focus on patients that actually need their attention. Are you impressed by these awesome examples of Chinese technology? Which one is your favorite? Let us know in the comments below. Also, make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, subscribe to Tech Division, and hit the bell icon for notifications.